Hey everybody, how's it going? It is Axel Grave and I am back with more reactions with an X doing the next episode of Shaman King, which I believe is episode 5. I think this is an oversoul. I can't remember the title of the episode, but it looks like it's going to be a pretty good one. We're moving through at a fairly quick pace. I think that it's two chapters to an episode so far, as far as manga, or far, sorry, two episodes of the old anime to one episode of the new anime because i went and looked when you would see people like lee pyrone and stuff and it seems like they're just kind of quickening the pace there at double time which isn't necessarily a bad thing but i do think some of the innate pacing of the emotional story and the kind of like touchy you know heartstring pulling things like the episode with rio are better at a slightly slower pace compared to more dramatic uh, impactful things like maybe uh, attack on titan or uh death note right where it's like yeah you can kind of really just kind of boom because it's a very action based and it's not necessarily about emotion as much as impact a lot of the times there's still a ton of emotion don't get me wrong but it's very like different it's very sudden impact not long standing with that said i've been enjoying it it's definitely not my favorite but it's got an okay rating it's definitely watchable which i think is important it's got decent music i'm really entertained by uh manta and anna and all the characters and the comedy so we're gonna get into it and see if it's you know continues to be that way and how long this series will last because i think the original one was only 60 episodes even at the other pace which i thought was even a little fast sometimes in the old one where they especially in later episodes where things got more complicated uh i do want to give a big shout out to everybody watching special shout out to the patreon viewers who get access to this stuff you know without all the extra audio and video cuts and also you know they uh, they also give a dollar and i appreciate that but also a big shout out to anybody watching on youtube and uh, anyone here watching live on twitch i appreciate all your support and you know it makes me happy that you watch i'm i'm, I'm voyeurs no i'm just kidding but uh yeah i hope you guys enjoy watching as well remember support the original content creator because without them they're they're like the most important step in this process right like if we don't have the content we can't watch the content and then you can't watch the reaction to the content and then you know so on and so forth so there's always a step one and that that step one is support them so if you haven't already go check this out on crunchyroll etc check out the manga and we're gonna go ahead and get into it because we're already three minutes into the intro and i hate doing long intros for those who don't know i hate doing long intros outros reviews that is crazy <laughs> He made it anyway. Hey, I remember that. He wants to be a chef. Hey, look at his hair. Did it go right? Did it go right? I'm, I'm going to be staying focused. Full of beans. <laughs> oh, that's what it means. His flat hair hitting the ground as a chef. Money, yeah, look at her. <laughs> look at, look at Yo with his little, like, beard. That's so fucking funny. Oh, I forgot about that. She can do that. He does that pretty often, actually. Like, two, two, one more time at least, I think. If I can still get punched in the face as a ghost, I'm gonna be pissed. <laughs> Whoa, I remember that from the manga. I really like their voices. Actually, all the voices have been pretty decent. Give me your powers! Give me your power! Oh no, they actually gave it to him. Did he summon the great shaman war? The, did he do... Is it him? I love the incorporation of Native Americans in this story, bro. Like, there's just not in my opinion and enough love put on native americans like you do see them from time to time in media 
but they don't get the love that they deserve as a culture. Like, yeah, we can go into it, but that's not the time. Oh god, him and his horse. And his stupid ass giant. Look at his, his fucking collar is popped. It's the biggest pop collar in history. Oh yeah, look at Silva selling some jade jewelry. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I love that they're always also depicted as broke and just having to sell the shit out of everything. Like tickets is, I know it's not necessarily the nicest depiction, but it's just so funny to me. It's just that struggle, bro. That's never like a nice. Oh god. Dude, his, his design is honestly so great. See, and the great part is this is the part of the story that moves fast, so this is great for this. I love that too that they have the great spirit. Honestly, Shaman King probably best encompasses my religious beliefs. I love the spirit flames. Look at how cool he looks. I don't like the gold coloring necessarily, but it's so cute and like cool at the same time. Level up, mana. <laughs> Damn it, we just got to the video game portion. We gotta, we gotta up our mana, bro. If you're having mana problems, I feel bad for you, son. I love that his spirits all talk trash, kind of. <laughs> Take a crap and go to bed. So vulgar. Also true. I remember this. He, this is so. He's gonna, it's so fucking funny. This is well. Oh, look at it. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, this is so far easily the best episode. This is good. This is just so good, honestly, all the way around. Well paced, the voice acting, music, animation, comedy. Yeah, look. This is actually pretty dope. This is one of the reasons Shaman King is like a badass top tier anime is the design. He's literally eating the sword in his hand. It's hilarious. I love the noise. <laughs> she is a pimp. She literally... I'm, I'm gonna pause it. Only this one. She literally made Manta come over and cook her food. She's pimping. There's no, there's no question. And die. And this is so funny too, because it really does go crazy on these Oversouls, man, and all these different things. Like, some of the characters are so interesting. <laughs> the world saving. 
She's so smart. This is so great. Hubris is a huge thing, man. <laughs> they did it well in this one. They they a lot of the time good. Cuz that was one of those good emotional moments where you get like attached to Anna. That's a little dark. They, I mean, I think it's to like indicate how bright his shot is. That's the other thing that they talk about is like he learns the moves by because of Mitamaro is Mitamaro has been using his body. What is this 80s video game music? This is like classic anime music, bro. I love it because he's really like this pretty boy character design, and then when you have the headband, he just turns into this badass. It's very Zoro esque. But I think he predates even Zoro, honestly. Because Shaman King's an old, old manga. Not like super, super old, like place closed or some shit, but. The bell. He, he got another one. It's really such a great collaborative, like. Story. May the great spirit be with you. Good luck, slacker. I love his fucking animals. They're such big shit talkers. Except for the bull who is just like, oh. He's so cool. I'm pretty sure this is exactly the end. We're gonna get a little tease thing here, so that's why I didn't end it. I remember this. That was a pretty good one, guys. I gotta say. I gotta say that was a very very good episode i enjoyed it extremely oh my god damn it netflix nobody just wants the ads to play for the trailers jesus okay but yeah honestly that was absolutely and easily the best episode that we've had so far uh in this new shaman king run and i gotta say i would really appreciated all the work that went into it I think they really did the emotional scenes pretty well. The fighting was fun. The story was done well. They're doing a good job on the end of episode, like teasers for the next episode, right? Where you see this happening or that happening. I do think that the next episode is going to be, I always forget the snow dude's name, but it's going to be snow dude probably because it's going to be the first fight in the tournament kind of thing. And it should be a pretty good time, guys. Like, it looks like it's kind of getting where it needs to be. I think they kind of move through the early portion of the story before the shaman fight really kicks off on purpose so they could get to the more action-packed parts that match the style they're using and the tempo that they're doing for the anime, right? Because this one's going faster than the old anime and definitely super fast compared to the manga. Uh, with that said, I'd love to hear what you guys have to say, so if you hit the comments or check out our Discord in the link below, you can come and chat with us about all the different shows we watch, including this, you know, One Piece, Tokyo Revengers, the movies we watch, all that great stuff. Once again, big shout out to the patrons. You guys will be able to see this episode with all the video and audio uncut. We've got a link on the Patreon, so thank you guys for that dollar a month. I really do appreciate it. Big shout out to the YouTube watchers. If you enjoyed, you know like comment subscribe if you want to see more or you can comment and just call me a shithead uh, that's also you know perfectly a valid thing but either way thank you for watching whether you liked it or didn't like it i appreciate you watching it and i hope to see you next time on reactions with an ex shaman king